In this video, I am going to show you how to download and install Fulbright for Minecraft Bedrock Edition 1.21.111. So, let's get started. The first thing you want to do is go to the description, and I will have a link in the description where you can find this Discord server right here. Now, the use of this Discord server, for you at least, will be this channel right here, called Fulbright Minecraft Bedrock Pack. Here, you'll find a little file called fullbrightminecraftbedrock.mcpack and this is a resource pack that modifies the brightness of vibrant visuals. So once you find this file here, just click download and this will just download the file for you. Now this is a resource pack, so to actually add it to Minecraft, what you want to do is simply go to your file explorer and this can also work on mobile phones, you know, iPads, tablets, computers, anything, basically, as this is just bedrock. So if you are able to have bedrock on your device, this will work for you. And another thing is that to open up the file to actually import into Minecraft, what you want to do is a couple things. If you see the logo, you can just double click it. If you don't see the logo, you can right click to open with Minecraft. And if you're like on a Android device or a mobile device, you'll be able to do like share with Minecraft or open Minecraft. You'll see something with Minecraft if you long press or right click the file. And the idea is just to find Minecraft somewhere and just click it. This will open up Minecraft and this is Minecraft Bedrock. So it will just load up and then you'll see that the file gets imported to the actual game. So here it is, import started and you just wait the time of it and it should just show up after a while when everything loads up there you go and once everything has loaded up simply go to your settings which is right here then you want to scroll down and you want to go to global resources you want to go to my packs and here you'll find night vision for minecraft bedrock here just click it, you'll see activate, and you activated it. So it is inactive here and it is right here. So if I go back to the home screen, it will load the resource pack. And now I can show you how it works. So if you go to a world, you know, it has to be like you know underground or nighttime. But if I just create myself a new world real quick, just to actually get a thing I can show you, I'm gonna do it nighttime as well so you'll be able to see it active another thing you can do is also change brightness of the game i'm going to show you this just after this so number one this is the game i just look for everything to load up i spawned in a broken chunk okay whatever uh the idea is that if i do slash time set midnight that you can just see a bit better from the get-go if you know how vibrant visuals look like this is definitely brighter Another thing you can do is make this even brighter by changing the brightness of vibrant visuals. So for example, if I go to escape, settings, and then you want to go to video, then here you have vibrant visuals options. Click this button and click adjust brightness. And here, just max this out like so and to continue. Now make sure to have vibrant visuals on with your graphics mode if you don't have this already, so make sure this is actually on because if you don't have vibrant visuals, this will not work. So that is one thing, but this is enabled by default. So I just expect you to have it. So going back here, as you can see, it is just like way more brighter. So that is something you can do if you want. So it just kind of makes everything nice and bright. So yeah, that is the idea of this resource pack. It just makes the default brightness brighter. And then if you want, you can make it even brighter. Now, let me show you how to disable the pack and how it looks like without the pack as well. So to disable the pack, you have to leave the game as the first thing. And then you want to go back to your home screen like so. Then you want to go to settings. Then you want to go down all the way back to global resources. Then you want to go to active, click on it and to deactivate. There you go. So now it is off. So if you go back to the home screen again, then you go back to the world, you'll be able to see just how much darker it is. So I'm just going to show you that real quick. Oh, 
Okay. And as you can see, it is just a bit darker. So yeah, that's one of the things you can do if you just want to add a bit more brightness to your game. This will just work for you. And yeah, that is the idea of this resource pack. It is just a little quality of life if you just want to make it like look like it was daytime or something. So yeah, that is what you can do if you want. So in today's video, I showed you how to download and install Fulbright for Minecraft Bedrock Edition 1.21.111. So if you liked today's video, make sure to like and subscribe, and see you for the next one. Bye!